Hello my little fizzies and welcome back. Today we are doing my December Foxy Luxe box. And I know it's early January, but I did not subscribe to this box until late January. I mean late December, so I wasn't expecting it until early January and I got it like a few days ago, but I've just been busy. <laughs> so it's just now getting unboxed, but I have it here now. Let's get into it. If you guys don't know, BoxyLux is seasonal and it is $50 a month. So let's get into it. You have to have the $25 subscription to the original Boxy, Boxy Charm, and then three times a year, December, March, June, October, no, September. So September, December, March, June, you can upgrade your $25 box to get the Boxy Lux. And this has nine items in it and a really heck of a good value. So let's open it up, see what we got. I did unsubscribe to all my Boxy Charms and all my Ipsies except for the $12 one. And I'm gonna see if I can do a semi no buy where I'm only spending $12 a month on one Ipsy bag and the rest of my stuff that I'm using, stuff I already own or stuff I get for free and gratis. So let's get into this box and see what's in here. The first thing, my favorite thing in the box, is the Storybook Cosmetics, Fairy Tales Storybox Cos Storybook Cosmetics. And this is the Briar Rose. And look at those beautiful colors. This is the Little Briar Rose Palette by Storybo Storybook Cosmetics, and it does retail for $55. And these colors would actually go with what I have on today those blues and golds so let's let's drop it on the floor let's do some swatches because it's really really pretty it is bulky it is thick but I'm glad that it has a mirror I've been using a lot of um, ColourPop and Morphe recently and there's no mirror so I'm having to like turn and look at the mirror to put it on because I'm blind so without my glasses I can't really look in the mirror unless I like hold something. So I actually really like that there's a mirror here. But let's take a look. So the one that I am immediately drawn to is Prince. And that looks really pretty. Let's do a little swipe. That's a nice blue. It could be more pigmented. I know I say that it's like bright blue. But let's see if I just lightly yeah so you really have to push down to get a good swipe but I will tell you that some of the other ones like this one has a different formula to it that shimmery one it feels a lot more buttery oh, let's do this one yeah that one has a different formula that's really nice so I'm going to get a lot of use out of this palette. I have so many palettes. I went through all my palettes yesterday and I'm like, I need to slow down. <laughs> like, why do I own so much? So this year I'm really gonna focus on just using what I have and doing a semi no buy. Um, I also just bought some permanent markers, some Sharpie pens, and I'm gonna write down the dates I received everything or I started opening everything. So I'd write, you know, January, 2020, on this palette so I know exactly when I got it so I'm not keeping expired makeup and I've watched a ton of declutters and people are like I have no idea when this is from so I'm like oh get up sharpie and write on there when it's from so I'm gonna go through and sharpie a bunch of my stuff and the stuff that I don't know how old it is is like question mark question mark but yeah oh let's play with let's touch this one too so this one is that other formula it has sparkles in it so it's not like this gold where it's super shiny. Oh, it's not bad. Kind of matches my lipstick. That is pretty. It has, it's like a, oh, you can kind of see those little sparkles. It's really pretty. But that shade, it's really pretty. Um, this is called Kiss. So, pretty close. <laughs> so this does retail for $55. And I am excited to use this. I'm going to break it out and use it tomorrow. And then whenever I go to work, people are going to be like, oh, it's on your eyes. And I'm like, uh, Clinique. <laughs> but 
but I am excited. I think I can get a lot of use out of this palette. And those are definitely colors I'm gonna like. That's that's one of the reasons why I subscribed later in the month. Because I wanted to see what was in BoxyCharm or BoxyLux before I paid $50 for it. So I, after I watched everybody else's unboxing, I was like, kind of want that box. So that right there pays for the whole box because after tax, this box costs like $55. So it's like buying that palette, getting the rest of this for free. So the next item that we received is from Rituals. It is Ritual of the Sock. Sakura celebrate each day as a new this is tr sensational foaming shower gel and organic rice milk and cherry blossom this does retail for nine dollars and fifty cents and everything in this box is full size <laughs> I was just wanting to get a little out so I could smell it and yeah it's already like foamed up a bunch I put a little bit in the cap and I don't know it's like growing. Can you guys see that? It's about to overflow out of this cap. Yep, it's starting to overflow. Okay, so a little bit of that goes a long way. I did not mean to do that. I just wanted to smell it. And now it looks like a little mushroom. And it just keeps growing. So, okay, I know. Oh. <laughs> I need to set this down. This is gonna go everywhere. That's cool though. I wasn't expecting it to do that. But I guess I should have since it's called foaming. <laughs> I gotta put this down. Okay, so I'm gonna stick this right there. Okay, so now I have soap all over my boxy box. Anyways, that's cool. It's not a real strong scent and that does retail for $9.50. So I'm gonna, I guess, use it to wipe off my swatches whenever we're done, so I'm not wasting all that soap. I feel like a dum-dum. Okay, let's move on. Let's not get soap on anything else. Let's take all of my stuff out of my box. Okay, the next item we received is by QMS, and it's Meta Cosmetics Lip Line Corrector Lip Serum. This is full size, and it does retail for $200. QMS is a really expensive um, spa skincare brand. And it says, formulated exclusively for the upper lip area, lip line corrector targets fine lines and wrinkles. This high performance lightweight serum is specifically designed to hydrate and plump lips for a smoother, youthful appearance. It's $200, so I guess you put it right here. I'm not really in need of that, so I'm going to see if I can put it maybe around the eyes or just use it on the entire face because if it works if it works above the lip line for lines and wrinkles wouldn't it work everywhere on the face like everywhere so i'm going to use it just as a regular face serum let's see how it feels so that's how it looks it feels very watery and very thin so they don't sell qms at um at Ulta but I have looked it up before because I think we got them in another box at one point or another and I looked it up and it was really expensive so this did not come in a box it came just like this but nowhere on it doesn't say it's made exclusively for BoxyCharm so I think they just took it out of the box so that you couldn't return it to the store or something like that I, I'm not sure but yeah and it has a six month shelf life so I'll make sure to write on there January 2020 so I make sure to use it up in that six months. If you guys didn't know, there's usually a trash can right there that tells you how long you should be holding your cosmetics and your skincares, skincares, skincare, so that you don't go above it, so it doesn't expire. And not all, it may not expire, like it may not smell bad, but it does lose its potency. So it's very important to to go by those dates. So I'll be able to use that. Oh, look at my bottle. There's like foam all over it. Ugh, I'm a mess. Okay, so if you guys got this, only use a little bit at a time. And I'll show you my boxy charm box because this is just continuing to grow. Like that, that mushroom has gotten big. We'll check in at the end of the at the end of the unboxing on my mushroom. All right, the next thing is another thing I'm excited about, and that I saw other people unbox, and I'm like, I want to try that. This is a Saturday Skin Waterfall Glacier Water Cream, 
And this is a Korean skincare brand, brand made in Korea. And it has Cha7 uh, peptide formula. Promotes skin natural regeneration process. So this packaging is super cute. It has the... Oh, that looks so cool. I love Lisa Frank. So anything like that, like that's just... Um, that's just so pretty. <laughs> it's just beautiful. I just go like that for hours. Anyways, okay. So this is um, 1.7 ounces. And that's what it looks like. It doesn't have much of a scent. I hope my hand is blue. Okay. Okay, I can't smell anything. Let's see if it has fragrance in it. Okay, it says dermatologist tested, no parabens, sulfates, synthetic fragrance, or synthetic colors. That's good. I work for Clinique, and Clinique has synthetic color, but it's also paraben and fragrance free and no sulfate. So I don't know if it has sulfates in it, but it does have synthetic color. So that's nice that this is no synthetic colors either. I'll definitely have to look into more Saturday skin. Maybe we'll get some more in our Ipsy bags. Look, it's on that side too. It's just so pretty. Up oh, there's the rainbow. So I am excited to try this from Saturday Skin. If you guys have tried Saturday Skin, let me know. And this retails for, let's get my handy dandy notebook. Saturday Skin, Saturday Skin. It retails for $39, which is pretty average. That's what the Clinique one um, advertises for, for 1.7, the moisture surge. Okay. The next thing that we did receive is the Fresh Soy, soy Face Cleanser. I've had a small one of these before and I don't think I liked it, so I'm not going to open this one. This one does retail for $48, which is expensive for 5 ounces of face cleanser. So I'm going to hold that aside for a future giveaway. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. Turn on notifications, follow me on social media so that you get notified whenever I have a giveaway. My birthday's coming up. So you guys are gonna get a treat. Just keep that in mind. Cause I have a lot to give you guys. The next item is In Beauty Project. It's Power Up Dual Face Setting Mist. Helps to set makeup, energize, revive skin, and filters away dull, tired, and stressed out complexion. Glow, hydrate, energize. Even though it's after midnight, let's give me a little energy. I like the spray on that. It's a nice spray. It smells a little strong, but not bad. Remember those Smashbox setting sprays we got that were like green and smelled like dirt? It smells better than that one. It smells, it smells like kitchen cleaner. Not in a bad way, it's like kitchen soap, I should say. It reminds me of the kitchen. <laughs> But I will definitely use that. Does my face look glowier, dewier, refreshed, energized? This does retail for $32, which seems expensive, but I guess that's the same price as probably um, All Night or something like that. So I'll have to look into it. I've never heard of In Beauty, but I'm definitely excited to try a new brand, which is why I get this box. <laughs> try new brands. Okay, the next item is... The Too Faced Rich and Dazzling High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss. I'm not going to swatch this because I know I'm not going to like this. I just recently decluttered a Too Faced lip gloss. I don't go through them that often. And even though that color is kind of similar to what I have on, or it's actually really similar kind of to that one because it has the gold sparkles in it, I'm not going to use it. Oh. And it has a lot of fragrance in it. Yeah, I'm not going to use that. I'm going to pass that on to someone else or put it in a future giveaway. Wink, wink. Okay, and that does retail for $21. The more I use Too Faced, the less I like the company. So I like a couple of their palettes, some of their blushes, some of their lipsticks, but overall, as a whole, I could do without Too Faced. It's one of my least favorite brands that Ulta carries. 
Okay, we've got two items left. Next item is Kat Von D Dagger Tattoo Liner, Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. I know Kat Von D is canceled, but I'm still gonna use this. This eyeliner retails for $20, and it's ideal for all makeup junkies. So, let's open it up. And I like the box, like it has a unique shape to it. I think that's cool. And let's give this a swatch. So that um, eyeliner that I was using, the Illamasqua, I ended up getting rid of it. I only used it for a week, two weeks. And then I was like, I'm done with this. I think that'll be fine. I like that you can do a thin or thick with this, depending on how you hold it. Because it's, um, the way it's angled is it's, I don't think you guys can see that. It goes thin and thick. Anyways, it has a cool, unique shape to it. So you can get really thin lines or really thick lines. So I think I'm going to actually really enjoy this. And I have tried her, was it called Trooper? Um, eyeliner before and I liked it. And this one's called Dagger because it has that unique shape to it. So I'm actually excited for this, even though she's canceled. Even though I am Team Jeffrey, this does retail for $20. And the last thing we have is by Siate. It's just a fun word to say. Siate. Siate London Confetti Highlighter and Warm Glow Highlighter. So this is a warmer glow, so I don't mind it though. I'm pale. Well, I'm not pale, I'm light. So there's like pale, fair, light, and I'm light. So let's, and then light, medium, medium, medium tan, tan, medium deep, tan deep, deep. Okay. I can see myself. Oh, you guys can see my room. Ooh, very reflective. So if you ever need a mirror, you don't even have to open it. You can just look at yourself. Now look, but they put a mirror in there anyways. I'm just easily amused. Okay, so this is the Confetti Glow Highlighter. Let's take my dirty hand. So yeah, it does look more like an eyeshadow, but I will definitely use it on the cheek as well. Just use a fluffy brush. That's actually really pretty. And I will definitely get some use out of it. Let's put some on the cheeks. Oh, yeah. Now I'm just extra dewy and shiny and glowy and that at all so hello <laughs> and this does retail Theate London retails for $32 which is pretty normal for a highlighter all right so the grand total for everything in my box was 40 was four hundred and fifty six dollars and fifty cents there was nine items so it made each item about fifty dollars and seventy one cents so it's nine items and I'm keeping seven of them and I'm giving away two. I am giving away both of these in a future giveaway so stay tuned for that. So even without those two items, I think 50 bucks for everything else is a really good deal. I definitely recommend Boxy Charm, Boxy Luxe, Boxy Premium, Ipsy, Ipsy Plus, Ipsy Ultimate, but I am gonna cut back because I have so much. But let's take one last look at our look at our mushroom before we go. <laughs> and that's how big it's gotten. <laughs> so let's touch it. Oh, it's thick. She thick. That is fun. Look, it's not even falling. When I turn into an AMSR, ASMR channel. <laughs> Anyways, is it taking off my makeup? No. <laughs> so it's definitely not a makeup remover. But I don't mind the scent. It's a, it's a little, 
it's not my favorite. I'd prefer something like rose than cherry blossom, but no, that's fine. But it's definitely not taking off that makeup. But all right, I gotta go wash my hands. I will see you guys soon in another video. Bye guys.